look at all these ones. So many bangers here, look. Look how unreal this is. Long sleeved and all sorts. Another one I've been after for ages. Look at that print, the flock, Nike ticks. Yes, what's going on everyone? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. I feel like a bit of a gimp saying that in the middle of London, but I'm in the middle of London today. I'm going to um, the Soccer Archive pop-up store on Oxford Street. I'm with my boy Scotty. Yes, Scott. Up Chelsea. <laughs> Up the Chelsea. He was at Chelsea Luton last night. Um, the Chelsea did the business. Sorry, Luton fans. Luton fans are getting to know what Ryan Giles is like at left back. But yeah, anyway, please remember to like, comment, and subscribe. Bottom right of the screen, as per usual. So yeah, on, today I'm on the hunt for. I want see, a. See if we can find some gems. Mate, I want some absolute gems. So the Soccer Archive sent me out a care package the other day with some belting Italy themed shirts. I've got the Italy 94 shirt. I've got the, um, what else? The Lazio number in there. There was some Venezia stuff, but today, on my hit list, football shirts has been an Atalanta, a late early 90s Atalanta shirt. I also want a the pink Juve Centenary shirt from 1999, I think it was, and also some skin tight Kappa, Italy and Roma, early 2000s. That's on my hit list today, and I've got a busy one today. So I'm up in London doing this stuff uh, with the football shirts because we've got the Fiorentina banger on, but I've also got a change of clothes later. So I'm getting in the car and driving up to West Brom to watch the Borough. But I'm a bit gutted because the trains are messed up, so I'm designated driver today, so no beers for me. But anyway, let's go and get McDonald's and get into it. Yes, I'm outside the Soccer Archive pop-up store. Let's get in there. Classic United, loads of United belters here, look. Oh. Skulls on the back. And look at all these ones. So many bangers here, look. 2002 Ronaldo. 1998 Ronaldo, World Cup final, obviously. Another Ronaldo. From 94, is it? And there's even some here. I've been told this is from the Olympics when Ronaldo wore Ronaldinho, R9 this is, wore Ronaldinho and wore number 18 at the Olympics in 1994. Umbro back in the day had some ridiculous shirts, didn't they? Now, what else we got here? We've got the classic Arsenal. Look at that print, the flock, Nike ticks. Obviously the main man, Dennis Bergkamp on the back. Such good condition as well, look at that. And look, look what I've just found here. Marseille, obviously a decent shirt, but check this out on the back. My hero, Ravanelli. What a player. Right, what else we got here then? We got some Dortmund, some Geordies. I think this is all the kids' kits actually. Right, here we go. The Irish shirt from back in the day. The Italy. I've just got this one actually. Italy 98. Pipo and Zaghi on the back. So many belters. And this is the one I've been after. Number 10, player prepared, long sleeves, cannot beat it. Look how good that is. And look who we got here, Paolo from the Soccer Archive. Paolo, tell me about this banger. All time favorite, Kanija, number 10 on the back. I mean, I was given, I was given this shirt when I was a kid by a, a, a family friend. Coming from my personal collection, yeah. One of the rare times that he wore number ten. Nice. He usually was number seven, number yeah. eleven sometimes. Yeah. Uh, right, oh yeah. What have you? Tell me a bit. Like that last one. I know. You, I know you're not prepared. Latte laugh. Tell me about him. Is right. he good? He's amazing. He's yeah. amazing. He's gonna do very well for you guys. Here we go. Thirty goals a season incoming. Top match. Here. Thank you. Got some other Lazio bits here. Is that the Mendieta days? Nesta. 
All right, what else we got then? Liverpool, more United. I'm trying to rattle through, man. All right, what else we got then? Mate, is that on Scotty? Yes. Denim. The oh, Napoli sure. denim. <laughs> check that out. Get that on with your Levi's. Oh. Let's have a look. Oh, mate, this is like football shirt paradise. <laughs> the Palermo. Palermo is missing from my collection, but that is one I want to get. I think the 94 one, is it? Oh, Roma, you cannot beat a Roma shirt. At the start of the video, I said I wanted a Roma Kappa skin tight. These are the days I'm talking about. Totty on the back as well. Woo. Can't beat it, boys. And another favourite of mine, obviously Kappa, the Betis days. I think Hector Bellerin had one of these bad boys on recently. Right, I found this Atalanta and I'm here with Jordan from the Soccer Archive. Jordan, mate, tell me what's going on today. Pop up Oxford Street in London, we've got loads of unbelievable football shirts, football jackets, the lot. Please, you need to get down here and look at some of the stuff we've got in it. It's absolutely fire, as you know, because you've got something in your hand. I'm here, mate, yeah. Got that absolute bang. I'm going to try it on and hopefully, how'd this work? Hopefully it fits me. But look at all these as well. A nice little setup here. Got some Venezia there. That is one of the Don Inter shirts. That's Dennis Burkamp days, isn't it? Early 90s. Another one there, obviously the classic Germany, and then what most people say is the iconic, most classic Italy shirt with Badger on the back, who obviously skied the pen. Yes, lads, I've got it. I've got what I came for. They've actually got one. Look how unreal this is. Long sleeved and all sorts. Don't know if you can see that on the back. Kanig Kanigia, is it? Is that how you say it? Kanigia, something along those lines. I need to get on the back. Look how sick this shirt is. This has been on top of my hit list for, must be a year now, this exactly one, in long sleeved. Lotto though, so I was thinking the size it might be a bit iffy, but sorted. And what a gaff this is, by the way. Look, check all this out. Some absolute classics here. Got the Holland, Croatia, obviously Modric on the back. Chiellini. Juve, Jamaica, the reggae boys. What else we got here then? But here's some I picked out here, look. Couple of bangers that I've picked out that are maybes. PSG, Nike and PSG just do the best shirts, don't they? Another German one. The reggae boys in XL. Another one I've been after for ages. And then, Check this one out. That Barca classic orange away shirt. Anderson on the back. You can't beat football shirts, can you? All right, soccer archive, pop-up store over and out. I am buzzing with that Atalanta shirt. Mate, when I walked in and mate, you saw me in my Fiorentina shirt, he was obviously an Atalanta fan. He weren't too happy, but when I said I wanted the Atalanta shirt, he was buzzing. And what a shirt it is. I've been after that for ages. Scotty. Oh, there's some absolute classics in there. I'd recommend going down. Some Chelsea beauties for me as well. What? In the what? Early 90s. Early yeah. 90s. The uh, 1988 to 91 and Red Away shirt. Yes. Oh. I like the old, the old Chelsea ones where you, you had a bit of orange on there back in the day. Yeah. They were the ones and the Commodore and all that type of thing. But yeah, absolutely loads in there. I'm buzzing with what I've got as well. Now we're off to, uh, off to West Brom to watch the Borough. Massive shout out to the Soccer Archive for inviting us down today. Buzzing with the shirt I got. Uh, make sure you go and check them out um, on the socials. And please remember to like, comment and subscribe for my YouTube channel where I'm going to be doing loads more stuff like this, loads of match day vlogs and chatting shit about football basically. So yeah, over and out. Oi, you. Yes, you. If you made it this far, thank you so much for watching. And please remember to hit the like and subscribe button if you want daily football content. And if you've got any football related videos you want to see me make, drop a comment and I'll see what I can do. Bang.